from 19th century when the industrialization started all the humanity has indulged into the love of this dunya the world you have the matter you are just creating creation ex materia take take the things manipulate it and try to make something else so you are keep loving this world the things are from this world to the primary sector iron copper gold nickel wood you take them out silicon sorry this uh, this uh, grain of the sand and make turn into silicon from desert things are there and then you manipulate those things and then you give your own creation and now you are putting all the people to love love it that is the what we are we call in islam materialism the love of ex materia you see when allah created everything it was kun fayakun be it is and we call it khalq at takween any matter which god wants to make it he just merely says be and the thing comes into existence there is no time and space involved in this time and space started after the big bang according to islam as well as according to the latest research of the scientists all those cosmologists allah says in surah al anbiya already that we had created everything with a big kind of a blast a spring reaction and everything came into existence and all the things are created from water even the air and the oxygen you take it that's why you see when you have cold in winters you see vapors develop on the window or windshield where do the vapor comes this vapor comes from where because the oxygen is in the atmosphere so you cannot evade yourself without water and your body contains water itself allah says everything is originated through water subhanallah this is the also message to the atheist who think that there is no god 1400 years ago allah is saying that all the creation lumped up is through big bang and every living things i created through water i took them out through water surah al anbiya chapter 21 and let me share with my viewers regarding the epistemology of knowledge you see all the knowledge the human beings have accumulated cannot surpass cannot go beyond these three knowledge number 1 the knowledge of cosmology everywhere you see humans from the dawn of the age is just looking to the stars heavens anything above you allah says the lowest heaven i have decorated with lamps stars big big stars big galaxies we are so much insignificant in front of the all these cosmological events we are nothing we are not even the speck of the speck you see we are being told in our books that we are living in the one of the arms of our milky way spiral galaxy and the distance between the center point is 27000 light years light needs 900 light covers 9 trillion 500 billion kilometers in one year in the roughly speed of 300000 uh, miles per second this is the speed which just able to finish 27000 years imagine 9 trillion 500 billion kilometers light covers in one year you need to multiply that and the unit becomes so massive only to cover your earthly years to understand and this is not one then you go beyond our galaxy we have billions of galaxies accumulated in one cosmology all this event quran says big bang and everything is originated through water your body contains water our atmosphere contains water we breathe all the time water vapors oxygen and takes out all the toxicity or toxics uh, these things from our body 
through our digestive system, sorry, rather I say excre excre excretory system, and through carbon dioxide. But it must be there. This is the miracle and miraculous ayah in the Quran if you really pay attention.